Hello, I'm Alison, Chief Exec of Accelerate. This video is part of a series that we're doing on self-management. This video is about management of your chronic edema, swelling or lymphedema. Now you may have lymphedema or chronic swelling anywhere in the body. The most common, of course, is the lower legs and your arms. So this is just some top tips to help you have better conversations with the nurse. So the first thing for you to think about is how you document your progress and how you can really make some objective measurements about your progress and whether you've got any problems. So a top tip is to have a little notebook where you are almost creating a diary for yourself. So the first thing to think about is your garment itself. So you may have been given a sock or wraps that have a liner sock and so on. So you can have wraps for your arms, sleeves, toe garments, hand garments, whatever. The question you need to ask yourself is, are they still a good fit? If they're not, why? What is it that you're feeling or experiencing that makes you answer that as a negative? Is it that it's rubbing? Is it too tight at a certain point? Is it that it's not containing the swelling anymore? Or is it that it feels too loose? and that you know it's not giving you the benefit that it used to give you. Take note of exactly what you're experiencing. Write it down in your book and tell the nurse what you're feeling. When you feed back to the nurse about the fit, they may ask you to take some measurements. Can you do it yourself or do you need somebody to help you? If the nurse was asking you about swelling in your arm, they will probably ask you to take measurements at the base of your fingers, at your wrist, your elbow and your upper arm. Again, jot them down in the book and feed back to the nurse. If you are being asked to measure your lower leg, this might be a slightly more difficult task. But again, what you'll be asked about is the measurement at the base of your toes, at your ankle, at the widest part of your calf, and at the top of your knee here, or just below your knee, but above your calf. You may also be asked to have a measurement around your thigh. So again, jot that down and compare and contrast with your previous measurements. If you have a particular area that's rubbing, note it down. Skin care. If you have chronic swelling, this would have been a major topic. So making sure that you have the creams and that you're using them regularly. If you have any special tubes of cream that are steroids, that you use them sparingly, but that you use them daily. So please again, take note of what you have or what you don't have. And if you've got dry patches, then note where they are, what helps or makes things worse. And then the other thing to look out for is signs of redness or inflammation, new pain, new swelling and so on. And if you're at all concerned, please call your nurse and ask for a conversation. But having objective measurements that you can pass on is brilliant for better conversations. The final aspect of self-management may be that you were taught how to do simple massage. Again, what were you taught about that? Are you able to continue doing this? Do you have any questions that you need to ask your nurse? So I hope that this short video about swelling management and self-management of this was helpful to you. Thank you for listening. Mm -hmm.